Let's now go across to visuals we are getting of a PFI march in Tiruvananthapuram. Remember earlier there was a similar march that was carried out in Rajasthan's quota and several questions that are now being asked as to why is it that the Congress government in Rajasthan gave permission for the same. Latest visuals of a PFI march over the same issue in Tiruvananthapuram and Ashwin is joining us live uh, to get us more details on the same. Ashwin, you know, despite PFI being banned in several states, dis despite PFI being declared a radical uh, hate group by the NI, you have on record a confession yesterday that we broke down details of, of how PFI is in fact leading these protests and now these kind of marches being allowed after Rajasthan, it's, in, it's, be, it's happening in Kerala. What's going on? Uh, what is happening right now that 19 locations in Kerala, there is going to be PFI March. Right now, I am at this location called as Puar Beach in Tiruvanthapuram and uh, it, this is where the PFI March is going to be held. It's a two-hour program that will be held. About 500 people in uniforms in Canada have already uh, standing over here to receive. Now, we have also get to understand that the PFI leader Kas uh, uh, Kasmi will be joining here and taking the salute and there will be all, all there's going to be a parade kind of uh, you know, like a uh, event that is going to be held in a short while for now. So at 4:30, the program will start. And what I want to remind is that 19 locations across Kerala, similar events are being held. Now I am in this location called Puar, which is known to have had uh, witnessed riots back in 2004 and 2005 between two minority communities. So this is a very sensitive area as well. And as you can see in these visuals, there is a, a complete arrangements have been done here, and about thousand people. People are attending. Uh, there is a, already a contingent. There is a. There is like a. There is like they have set up a, a cadre. A cadres are already waiting for receiving the salute, and there are also women also uh, assembled at the sidelines uh, to see to witness all the uh, marches that is going to be held and the program that will be held over here. What is important is that the PFI is holding this march as part of their foundation day, which falls on February 17th, and what is expected is that uh, uh, speeches will also be given here in this venue in a short while from now after uh, the the march the contingent will march here uh, within the beach premises itself and further to which what needs to be seen is uh, how uh, uh, what are the kind of leaders who will be coming over here to give speeches to the cadres over here to speak about the uh, cu current contemporary issues including uh, we are also expecting that they will be speaking about the hijab controversy as well so all this will be high will be the highlight at Puvar but it's important to know that this is one of our sense areas where they've just witnessed some uh, uh, conflicts in 2004 and uh, such a location like that uh, like that uh, there is a march that has been held at 4 30 the march will start about 500 uh, cadres are here right as we can see in these visuals and they will be taking on the march and it was a two hours program which will be held about 100 police officers have been deployed at this very spot and uh, similarly in 19 locations across Kerala in Tiruvanthapuram there are two locations where these marches are being held other than that outside of the capital city 17 other locations will also have similar kind of marches which will be held and this is called as a unity march of the pfi and this is also a show of strength of the uh uh, of the PFI and the affiliate political party, the SDPI. And as you can see, the, the flags of SDPI furling across and about kilometers away, all the flags have been set up and it has been completely set up over here. Remember, it is because of COVID that the entire um, program has been downsized. So this is actually what you see is a miniature program. It's not the full-fledged program because of COVID, they have cr created less number of people, only less number of people have been allowed to uh, assemble over here but what is important is that Puwar and be in the Puwar beach right at the Puwar beach a contingent about 500 people are going to take a march and a two hours program it will also show the strength of uh, the PFI in the state back to you absolutely so that's the PFI's plan as far as uh, celebrations of their foundation day are concerned annual meetings and marches to take place across the country. First up, we picked up visuals from Kota and Rajasthan and now from Tiruvananthapuram in Kerala. Thank you, Ashwin, for that.